everyone, it's Nona Grace and I'm from Western New York. Today I want to remind you that tomorrow, now this is tomorrow, the Christmas star is supposed to be out there. And I looked up to see when is the best time and which direction you're supposed to look. Well, you're supposed to look, I, I wrote it down so I don't get it wrong. You're supposed to look to the southwest sky about an hour after sunset. Do you want to know when my sunset is? <laughs> my sunset's at 4.43. <laughs> it's early. Do you want what, to know when my sunrise? What, what, are the, what are the weathermen forecasting for tomorrow? Oh, we're supposed to get rain, I think, and cloudy, snow, cloudy. Um, yeah. If you have a clear sky, you've got a better chance. We are supposed to have a not as such a pretty sky. We had um, a little bit of clearing earlier today, and then it kept getting worse and worse and worse. And so our skies are not the prettiest right now. Ours are real clouded over. But I look to see when our sun rises, because it's dark when I get up. It's really dark. It's at 7.31. That's when sunrise is for us. So we don't even, we get about 9 hours and 15 minutes of daylight. Aren't we lucky? But what is tomorrow? Tomorrow? It's the longest day of the yeah, year. Yeah, it's for the us. longest day of the year. It will the, so we'll start moving back up. Yep. Woo woo! We're <laughs> gonna get some more daylight. <laughs> that means the rooster will Not crow much, more often. <laughs> he was Goog you wanna know what he was googling? I got up this morning and I says, What are you doing? And he was googling. He was googling to see why roosters crow in the middle of the night. <laughs> and I thought, oh they it's because they're telling Predators out there, I think. I don't know mm. why they, nobody knows why they crow. They just crow. If they see they, lights or they think it's uh, sunrise coming, they will they will crow at that point. Well, it's not or, coming at 2 a.m. in the morning. No. <laughs> but their car some, lights maybe set them off. Could the be truck lights. car lights, uh, we live house not lights, far. Any, any light. Maybe the Christmas lights across the street. Could be Christmas lights. It could be in the neighbor down the road a little uh -huh. bit that has their lights on all night. Yeah, it could be. Never but anyways, know. he crows any time of the day. And um, Mr. Brown laid an egg today. Okay, what I wanted to tell you too is that because um, we got eight eggs today. And I have a new little hen that's laying. And Jim goes, well, there should be more than one little hen laying besides that new little one. And I says, winter. They need a lot more hours of daylight. And mm -hmm. so um, I looked up to see, okay, how many hours of daylight do they need? Well, they need at least 12 hours of daylight, but they do better if they have 14 to 16 hours of sunlight. And they're not even getting the 10, 10 hours. They're getting 9 hours and 15 minutes of daylight. So we're lucky mm -hmm. we're even getting any eggs. Mm -hmm. So that's what I wanted to say today. Just remember, tomorrow is the day that you see the Christmas star. And what it is, is that Saturn and Jupiter are going to line up. And um, Saturn, Jupiter is behind Saturn, and Saturn will just keep going. And if you look, the, the best time is one hour after. If you wait too long, it's gone over the horizon, and you're not going to see anything. So that's why La Bafana probably can't find this, the Christmas star. It went too far mm -hmm. beyond the horizon. So I guess that's part of the story of today. <laughs> so I'm all done and I hope you all have a great day and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye.